So one question that was asked to me is if one used melatonin for a couple of months and then stopped using it, will the person naturally, um, will the person's natural circadian rhythm and melatonin levels return? Well, I would say that the easiest way to figure out if melatonin secretion levels come back naturally is to go ahead and stop the melatonin uh, supplementation and see if you can go back to sleep at that same time uh, and keep trying after a while. But after a while, so maybe after one or two weeks, it doesn't come back. You might want to see a doctor to make sure their body or your pineal gland is still uh, secreting melatonin at the correct times. Um, you know, older people actually have this problem where they secrete a lot less melatonin at night when they're supposed to go to sleep. And that's why they have sleeping problems. And uh, my, the last thing I'd like to mention is that our circa, circa, circadian rhythm um it's set by the cues that um is set by the cues of daylight like for example in uh, nighttime uh the lack of daylight for example when um during the morning if you're exposed to the sun there's blue light in the sun which stops the uh secretion of melatonin and allows you to uh stay awake you feel more uh that's why you observe if you're out in the sunlight you feel awake you know, but uh, at night, without the sunlight, when it becomes darker, then you know, the melatonin starts being produced in the pineal uh, gland, and you feel like falling asleep. Now, the problem with the the modern environment is that you know we lo use a lot of artificial lighting that uh, stops the production of melatonin, ma making us kind of lag and end up staying up later at night and later at night, messing up our sleeping cycle and our sleeping quality. So one solution to this problem is simply to make sure that at night to uh, lower down your levels of um, what would what should I say blue light um, exposure or you know some people they just take a small amount of melatonin to compensate I don't know how safe um, constant melatonin use is I'm not a doctor but I would suggest um, lowering your exposure to blue light. That's the safest bet because that's what uh, people are naturally used, uh, used to. Thank you for listening. If you have any questions, please feel free to ask me in the comments below. I'd appreciate it if you like and share this video and, sub and subscribe to my YouTube channel. And, uh, I th uh, you know, uh, it was interesting answering your question. Bye.